Ooh, Lucas Arts. Hey everybody, Toxic Curve here, back for episode two of the Secret of Monkey Island. We're back where we left off. We were just talking to these clowns, the men of low moral fiber. And if you remember, we got two pieces of eight by taking one of their PTA meeting uh, notes. So, if you remember, we're trying to complete the three trials. We need to get a sword and get trained and beat the sword master. We need to find the lost treasure of Melee Island. And if you remember, the shady guy over here has got the map. <clears throat> and then also, our third trial is we need to sneak into the governor's mansion and steal the idol of many hands. So, um, yeah. We're going to pick up where we left off and see what we can find. So it looks like we have these guys over here. We already talked to them. There's a door over here. So we could go in here and see what we find. And let's go inside. Ooh, creepy. So there's some chickens. And look at chickens. Poor chickens! These chickens are dead! I'm gonna get turned into some. Love that chicken for Popeyes. <laughs> okay, can we pick up a pagan ritual? Who wouldn't want to spoil it? That is true. You do not mess with pagan ritual. So we can open the baskets. I'm not that curious. <laughs> He's smart. Hmm, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. It's kind of a weird thing. Can we pick that up? Yes! We now have a rubber chicken with a pulley. Oh dear. Can you read my bones? Uh, yes. I mean, we want to know, right? Oh, sick. That's awesome. A giant monkey. Ah. Uh oh. Looks like we get eaten by a giant monkey. Right, we're in part one. <laughs> you will hear many things better left unheard. You will learn things better left unlearned. What kind of things? I hate surprises. No, the time is not right to know. When you know your purpose, come see me. I will let you know then. Hmm. That's not ominous at all. Ah, she's gone! Where did she go? Well, that wasn't crazy at all. Okay. Um. Well. 
They did say back in the scum bar to talk to a guy named Esteban about the governor. Maybe he knows a way to sneak in. Esteban. Oh, he's got a scar on his eye. <laughs> Excuse me, but I'm looking for the dartboard. Can you tell me the story about this LeChuck guy? LeChuck! He's the guy that went to the governor's for dinner and never wanted to leave. He fell for her in a big way, but she told him to drop dead. So he did! Then things really got ugly. I'm kind of curious how he died. He tried to impress the governor by sailing off to find the secret of Monkey Island. But a mysterious storm came up and sank his ship, leaving no survivors. Well, poop. Thought that was the end of the fearsome pirate LeChuck. We were wrong! Ah! I love his face. <laughs> That's awesome. What happened then? He still sails the waters between here and Monkey Island, TM. His ghost ship is an unholy terror upon the sea. That's why we're all in here and not out pirating. I'm looking for the dartboard. <laughs> Did the accident happen to him? Is that why? Yeah. What happened to your eye? <laughs> Was it the dartboard? <laughs> oh, he's putting in his contact lenses. Wait a second. That's none of your business. Hey, I was just curious, man. I'm sorry. Yeah, so what? I'm walking here. But that could take all day. He does look busy. Sneak into the kitchen. Could be something useful in there. Hey! You can't come back here! Fine. I will wait for you to notice me. I want a drink. <gasps> he left the door open. Quick. <gasps> yes. Ooh, what's this? I want a hunk of meat. <laughs> meat like substance. Pick up hunk of meat. Is that the Pillsbury Doughboy? <laughs> it's boiling hot. I don't see anything to put it in, unless we can take this pot and fill it with grog. I drink a whole pot of grog! Someone 
good, good, good. Cheese in this. Ooh, we have a pot and uh, uncle meat. It's out here. Oh, this bird. Ooh, a fish. I want this fish. Ah, he pecked my hand. Stupid bird. It's over here. Can I push the bird? No. There needs to be a kick button. Uh, use pot with fish. No. Suck it, bird. Take your butt. Suck on that, you dirty animal. It's a herring. Well, we got a fish. I, I don't think there's anything else we can do in here right now. But you can see our... <laughs> look at that guy's belly sticking out. We're starting to get a nice little inventory of items here. So, I guess let's go see if we can figure out how to get some money or get a sword or something. Or sneak into the governor's mansion. Is this a thing? Walk to sign. Ye old rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle shop. <laughs> Serving your rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle needs for over 50 years. Well, we don't have to go there because we already have a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Can I go this way? What's this? Nothing. Okay. It's... <gasps> There's a door. What the hell? What about this door? Where does this go? This is confusing. I don't. <laughs> so there must be shortcuts, maybe. I don't know. That seems like that doesn't really do anything. That's funny though. Okay, is there a church? What's this? Psst. What was that? Who's psting me? Hey, you! Come over here. I'm scared. I want to go in this alleyway. <sighs> Fine. Hello? Oh, that's a creepy circus poster. Anybody in here? Oh, he's behind us. Hello? You know, bad things could happen to a person in a dark, deserted alley like this one. And at a time... At this time of night, nobody would be around to see it. Oh, really? That's interesting. Well, see ya. <laughs> Did you hear something back here, too? Yeah, bad things happen to people who sneak up on... Yes, this. Because I'm a pirate. I'll hurt you. Eh, so you're going to give me a little attitude, eh? I'd better get your name. Yeah, I'm new in town. I was just leaving. I'm a mighty pirate. Yes. I'm Guy British Three Board, and I'm a mighty pirate. Listen, Peepwood. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Whatever your name is, listen. I'm the sheriff around here. Sheriff Fester Shine Top. <laughs> Take it from me. This is a bad time to be visiting Melee Island. Fester Shine Top. A very bad time. My advice to you is to find somewhere else to take your vacation. 
somewhere safer. I don't like that guy. He's got a great name, though. <laughs> I sure feel better knowing there's an officer of the law around. All right. Let's look at this poster. Ooh, a circus. <laughs> I love a circus. Anything in here? Some barrels. Doesn't look like it. Well, that was interesting. Guess we're supposed to watch ourselves. Anyway, back to what I was doing. Opening this door. Ahoy there, fancy pants. <laughs> Shopkeeper. What do you want? Uh, I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. The Swordmaster of Melee Island? DM. Hmm, I don't know. Nobody knows the whereabouts of her secret hideout. Nobody except me. I'd have to go and ask her if it's okay to... To show you the way. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Once. Be right back. It's a nice old dude. but Cane. Thing. Don't touch anything. Okay. Ring bell for service. Well... What's over here? Uh, door. A ship's wheel. A shovel. <gasps> Wait, is this a sword? Oh, look at the sword. Slash master. When you want a sword as sharp as your wit. Hmm. Wonder how much that costs. Let's see, there's a big safe up here. Oh, I just wanted to look at it. I'm sorry. Davy Jones lockers, the last word in theft, fire, and grog resistant storage devices. That's the best. And a shovel. Dig Master, the only shovel for serious treasure hunting enthusiasts. Well, I mean, we do have to dig up some treasure, and we do need a sword. Uh,. Is he going to come back anytime soon? Should we ring the bell? <laughs> it never fails. I step away from the counter for two seconds and some idiot's already ringing that stupid bell. Did you make it all the way out there and back? <laughs> Jump in a lake, by the way. What do you want? Uh, oh, do we have to look at the things while he's here, perhaps? This ain't no boutique. Don't take our day. Grumpy old man. about this sword? What about it? How much is it? Is it two pieces of eight? Come on. One hundred pieces of eight? <sighs> Take it or leave it. I don't have enough money. Will you loan it to me? Figures. <coughs> Well, uh, let's see how much this shovel is. So, so far we need 198 pieces of eight, and we have two. Well, we need 200, and we have two, 198. Maths. Pick up. Shovel. Talk to storekeeper. Let's go, fancy pants. <laughs> About the 
his shovel. Two pieces of eight, right? Another would be treasure hunter, eh? 75 pieces of eight. Oh my goodness. Uh... Well, then you'd better go put it back. I like this guy. He's no nonsense. Is there something maybe here that you can afford? I don't know. What if you got for two pieces of eight? A piece of bubble gum, maybe? Well, I guess let's move on. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. Hey, it's more Sabertooth Tiger stained glass action. I don't see anything to do. I like this music though. It's great. Pretty heavy. All right, so we have a church, some kind of fort. Oh, it's a prison. It's locked. <gasps> There's a rat. Is that the rat? Hey, I found your rat. <laughs> you gotta get me out of here. I'm a victim of society. Not to mention halitosis. Whoa. Hey, it's hard to keep my breath minty fresh when there's nothing to eat in here but rats. This guy's been eating that other guy's rats. Let's see. <laughs> talk to Death Breath, you know what I'm saying? Mm, so maybe if we find some mints, we can talk to him. He is a victim of society, you know. All right, what's over here? Ooh, yes. Oh, fancy. Is this maybe what? Oh, yep, Governor's Mansion. <gasps> Are these the dogs? I thought they said vicious. Br oh, piran piranha poodles. I don't think I can get past them. Lock to door. No. So, we have some meat, but he was saying drug them, so we need to find some roofies, apparently. I think that's it for over here. And probably everything for here in town, because we seems like really we need to find some money. That's kind of our main thing at the moment. So, let's make our way back out of town. Past the old Mr. Shifty. Past the dock, let's go back up to the cliffside. And I think that is going to give us a good stopping point here. I feel like we don't want to get too much more into uh, the rest of the island yet. We'll leave that for the next episode. See if he has anything information wise. What's green and hairy and has a thousand legs?
Yikes. You almost scared me to death. <laughs> I thought you were a... Never mind. What did you say your name was again? Driver Sweetwood, call me Squinky. I'm over this way. Who are you? I'm over this way. Ah! <laughs> oh! I'm Grybar Streepwood. I came to Melee Island because I want to be a pirate. Well, you picked the right place for it. Though perhaps the wrong time. Not to mention the wrong name. You will have the silliest name I have heard in a long time. What the heck's wrong with Guybrush Threepwood? Nothing. If you want to sell shoes, you want to be a pirate boy, take my advice. Change your name. Try something like Dreadbeard or Six Fingered Beat. Who are you? I'm the lookout of Melee Island. I watch the ocean for approaching storms and ships and report them directly to the governor. She doesn't like unexpected visitors. Especially not now. <laughs> She's probably worried about Ole Chuck. Actually, it's the expected visitors we're worried about. One pirate in particular. A dead one. But that doesn't make him any less dangerous. <laughs> yeah, because he's blind. Watch your tongue. I was handpicked by Sheriff Shine Top. Hmm. Good luck. Good luck to us indeed. All right. Well, I think we'll end. Oh no! Eh, just kidding. I think we'll end this episode here. And uh, yeah, so next episode we'll get into adventuring around the rest of the island and seeing what we can find and dig up so thanks for watching and i will see you guys next time